welcome to another Miss Alley Camp DIY video. Uh, sorry it's been so long, but um, today I'm going to show you some simple and easy ways to vamp up your holiday gift wrapping. Um, so yeah, let's begin. So today I'm going to show you how I decorated these three gifts. And I think they're super easy and quick, last minute approved. And yeah, let's continue. I hope you enjoy. So to do this, you can use a Sharpie pen or you can use a paint marker, a paint pen. Um, I recommend the paint pen just because it's a more vibrant color, but be sure to shake that well. And also try it on a piece of the uh, wrapping paper that you're not using so it, you know that it doesn't go through the paper onto your gift. With that being said, after you've given your paint marker a good shake, unless you're using a sharpie, go ahead and draw your little uh, paw prints. For all my paw prints, I'm doing drawing a heart, and at the very um, tip of the heart, I am drawing two little ovals, and on the outside of the tip of the heart, two more little ovals, as you can see here. And I'm just drawing these all over, randomly, all over the package, so it looks like um, a little kitty walked all over the gift. So for this next idea, we're going to be using this plain green paper. This is like a craft paper that you can um, design your own um, packages. Um, this is just what I have on hand, and so I'm going to make a real quick elf inspired easy gift wrapping idea. So for this next gift I'll be using this gold, it's actually sticker paper, comes in a pack of three I think from the Dollar Tree and just a white piece of paper, any white paper will do. I'm also going to be using this black ribbon, um, it's not from Dollar Tree but Dollar Tree often carries ribbon so you never know if they'll have black ribbon. And I've got my hot glue gun preheating. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to make a collar for our elf. And to do that, I'm just going to be using a pencil. So I'm going to be drawing some like triangles for our um, collar for our elf. You don't have to be real talented. I'm just making some random shapes. Here, some like, well not random shapes, but um, some triangles. And now I'm just going to go ahead and cut this out. So I went ahead and glued on my triangles to the center of my package, um, putting them in the placement that I wanted. Uh, looking back, I should have like cut them where I wanted them first, but no, I decided to glue them and then I cut them. It'll make more sense when you see what I'm doing in the video. But it worked. Um, it actually made it pretty easy. I just cut them off and then glued the triangles to the back of the package. Um, so either way you want to do it, if you want to cut them first or cut them afterwards, totally up to you. Alright, so the next thing I did was I took my um, black ribbon and I cut it the length or I guess the width of my package in this case. Um, and I went ahead and glued that down with my hot glue. I suppose you could just use a glue stick, but I wanted it to stick, so I used hot glue. Alright, so now I'm taking that sticker paper from Dollar Tree and I'm just cutting out a square. Um, yeah, I'm just cutting that out and then I'm going to go ahead and take a razor blade. If you are a kid, be sure to get a parent or an adult to help you with this because razor blades are a little sharp. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and cut out another square inside that square and that should make sense with what you see on the screen. wrapping idea. It's super simple and I think it's adorable. 
It's so cute. It's a little elf. And on to the next. So idea. for this next idea to vamp up, we have a red package now with that like craft um, paper that you can customize. But if you have some plain paper and you want to vamp it up a little bit, you can use washi tape. I got these washi tapes um, during the summertime at Michael's. So they were really cheap, like less than 99 cents, I think. So anyway, you can glam up your gift with some washi tape. So that's what I'm going to go ahead and do. And I have this other paper, this green paper, out of the same kind of craft material, kind of like a paper bag um, consistency or material um, paper. I'm going to make a bow out of this, and it's really cool because this paper actually twirls when you um, when you curl it with scissors. And yes, this is a very poorly cut shape. We're going to ignore that, and because you're not going to see it. So, yeah. So what I'm going to do ah, is I'm, oh my goodness. Okay. I'm just going to set something right there so that it doesn't move on me. And I am going to make um, some strips, and I'm not going to go all the way to the center. I'm going to do this on both sides, and I'll fast. Done that on both sides, you can begin curling. And as always, if you're a kid, get your parent to help you out because um, scissors are sharp. <laughs> or any adult, I suppose. Any capable adult. I'm just going to start curling all of the edges, all of the paper. All right, so just a tip when you're curling this paper, don't pull it too tight. I did that and I had a couple strips break, um, but in the end you couldn't tell that. Um, so if they do break, it's not really that noticeable. But to avoid that, don't pull it super tight. I did end up making mine a little bit skinnier just cause it kind of helped a little bit. So it ended up um, a couple inches wide. And um, the length doesn't really matter because you're curling it. And I'm just going to fold both uh, pieces. Just fold it in half like this. Kind of place that together. And um, fold it again. And I'm just going to go ahead and tape this down to my package. Taking a piece of tape and folding it over on itself. Putting that on the bottom of our little like makeshift bow and taping it down. I'm also going to do that one more time on there. And I'm just going to go ahead and mess around with the paper just to kind of create a little like makeshift bow. So and there you have it. Here is a quick and easy way to decorate your gift using some washi tape and some paper, some plain paper. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this Miss Alley Cat DIY gift wrapping ideas.
I hope you all are having an absolutely wonderfully perfect day. Don't forget to pounce on that like button and hit subscribe. And of course, have an absolutely perfectly Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year, of course. And until next time, Miss Alley Cat DIY signing out.